Hi, I am Colonel Sunil Prem. I am an ex Fauji, and this is my second avatar in the civilian world. Apart from other things, we are also doing some things for defence, trying our hand at entrepreneurship, innovation. So I'll just show you this bridge of ours. So you see this. So what happens is this is a typical bridge which is required by a soldier. A soldier has to not just cross a water obstacle. He has to go across and also fight the enemy. So now, how does he take a bridge along with him? We solved this problem by converting this into a trolley, a wheelbarrow. So, yeah, yeah. So what you do is you pull it like this. Thereafter, if there is, and then when you reach the point where you have to launch it, you open it out like it is shown there on the board, right? Down there, and this little thing turns into this bridge. and you just connect it i'll try to show it to you in a second like this and it comes here and then you just connect it like he will connect it and it turns into a 50 meter 100 meter any kind of a bridge now what you will oh robust means i'll invite you to get on top of it and try it yourself yeah yeah don't worry you can walk across You can jump if you want. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Vipin, Vipul, aja, mar chalang. So nothing happens to this. So this is built for a soldier. It is built for misuse. You understand? Obviously, because he is more worried about fighting at that time, right? He is not bothered about. using or misusing the bridge so it is built for misuse because imagine abhi to hum din mein kar rahe hain all this is happening at night there is firing taking place there is shelling taking place and he has to go across he is carrying his weapons rifle lmg grenades his packs and then he has to take it to the river in the darkness launch it cross it and attack the enemy you can float uh, in even oh yeah so this if even if you puncture it fire a few bullets on it if you if you have artillery sharp, shrapnel it will not sink it's an unsinkable kind of a bridge so why the wheels sir wheels is see now uh, the guy when you have to get to the bridge side it's a walk of a kilometer kilometer and a half right now imagine for one and a half kilometers you carrying a bap that is a boat assault pneumatic six people carry one bap right six people are going to carry it reach the water launch into the water and god forbid find that it is punctured here one person can pull this right and if there is a khada or something two people can lift it and get there just imagine the huge difference it makes to a soldier and the speed of launch is very very fast so, uh, this is made up of composite this is made of composites it is metal composites and these are plastic composites and we've tried uh, you know carbon composites too not ideal for this situation because i am an engineer they have got uh, you know they have got different characteristics and this is good enough as you've already seen it is extremely tough very light and totally serves the purpose and that's how it works not just for the armed forces disaster relief yes. you had floods recently yes, yes. right for events the kumbh mela is coming up yes. so you need uh, bridges for vips for all the people literally lakhs millions of people come there and it can be customized customize built in so the armed forces make a 50 meter bridge in 30 minutes so what is the production capacity suppose uh, you have a company you have the material you have the system in place right. how much uh, you can produce because india is such a big uh, country and our armed forces so huge so here i what i will say is the tough part we have already crossed the tough part which is the design and you know solving all these problems which seem very minor but there are major problems but there after production is a question of just because everything now we have the dies ready the molds ready and you have the all the so you have sort of you know uh, design farmers for each one of the parts for each one of the joints for each one of these uh, you know deckings which you see there after it is a question of just you know a conveyor belt kind of a thing so a 50 bridges 100 bridges is not a problem at all so what is next like um, so this is not the only thing uh, we do so we are in the final stages 
because this bridge is now awaiting final formal trials because the army has to follow its process, of course, and thereafter then it gets inducted into the army, uh, God willing. And uh, meanwhile, we are getting a lot of uh, you know outreach from the you know disaster relief kind of organizations. Also, as I told you, for the Kumbh Mela and for other events, because this can be put up and removed very fast. And here we see a lot of foreign countries. Are they taking interest in this? Oh yes. So I will be. I was to be. I was to visit uh, Africa. I got postponed. But uh, think of our neighbors. Think of Africa. I have been in Africa. I served there for a year. And by chance, I was in a location where there was no bridge on one side. Now imagine something which you can put up in a few hours, and thereafter, as per need, take it off and put it up again somewhere else, wherever you want. Sorry, I interrupted you. You were telling me something about other products as well. Which oh, we have uh, something called an identification of friend or foe between tanks, and uh, this is a system. Imagine there are tanks at night fighting. And when you are firing, you don't know is it my tank or the enemy's tank, because you are firing at distances of two or three kilometers. So we developed the identification of friend or foe system (IFF). It is pure electronics, communication software, where the moment before when you press the LRF, the range laser range finder, in the tank before you take a pot shot at another tank, it immediately tells you whether that tank which you are looking at is yours or the enemy's. Wonderful. Hello, Sunil Premji. I'm so uh, glad that I have you on my channel, National Defence. Thank you very much. Great product, and you care for our army, our soldiers. Perhaps uh, I believe that not only our army but our friendly countries' army would also take interest in it. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you.